The fight didn't last long, just over eight minutes and less than three full rounds. That didn't stop the Thomas Hearns Marvin Hagler championship fight in 1985 to be considered one of boxing's greatest. There was no love lost between the two men, and right as the bell sounded to start the match, it was on. A slugfest from the jump, heavy blows were traded with little regard for defense or pace. Hearns had been stunned while the reigning champ Hagler had been cut, and ring announcer Al Bernstein remarked, perhaps one of the best opening rounds in middleweight history. The Ring magazine took that a step further and called it the greatest round in all of boxing. Hearns' legs were gone in the second. Hagler methodically took him to the ropes, landing a volley of punches, though the round ended tightly contested. In the third, Hagler's earlier cut opened up, resulting referee Richard Steele to stop the action and have the ringside doctor take a look. He let the fight continue, and the champ attacked with aggression. Hearns couldn't withstand the barrage and fell to a vicious right hand for the knockout. Boxing News called it eight minutes of mayhem, and it is rightfully considered among boxing's greatest all-time batters.